Gaffer, uh, today you've completed the signing of Jake Hasty on loan till January initially. Um, give us your reaction to that. Well, d delighted obviously, we've been working on it for a while and um, the Rangers have been fabulous. Um, you know, it's, I think it's our job to try and you know, breathe a bit of confidence into Jake. I think he lost his way a little bit, but anybody that, that saw him burst onto the scene and uh, only a year, he's only 22, a year or two ago, he's at great pace play off the right or off the left um, and he's a, he's a big addition I've said to him it's basically I'm not really worried about any tactics I'm, I just want him to get the ball beat people cross the ball score goals that's the hardest job in football and to go and really enjoy playing football that, that, that's that's the thing for him and hopefully um, come January he'll have done so well that we're desperate to keep him but he might have other offers who knows so he's a great addition to us and it's the first thing he's got to do is get in the team because the team's doing really well and uh, he knows that so um but he's a good addition and hopefully as a, as a young guy hopefully he'll do really well yeah as you've said this is created terrific competition especially middle to front giving you the kind of headache that you want to have yeah i mean most parts of the team are complete now i still think i need three players although Jack and the board will probably disagree with me there, but um, even if we get two, it's pretty obvious where we're quite light now um, due to Dan's injury. Um, so I think defensively, we certainly need t two defenders, you know. But you know, listen, I'm, I'm like one of our greatest managers, the great Lambino. He was never happy, he always wanted two extra players. But, you know, the seasons have went great, the board have been fantastic. You know, Rangers have done a great deal for us as well, for for, for, for Jake, so, but we are short defensively. I, I, I'm very happy with the back four that performs so well against them, Fairman, but if you add Stephen Bell to that, we've only really got five defenders, so the very minimum we need two in. Yeah. Message to supporters, you're working on it, but the window will be open until August the 31st. These things can take time. Yeah, they can. I mean, I, I'm pretty hopeful of having one this week, um, but the, the supporters are probably fed up me saying that, but we've worked hard on it and... Um, Hopefully well, he'll be able to, it's a, a lad that can play centre back and right back, um, so hopefully that can get completed this week, fingers crossed. And since we last had the chance to speak to you, um, Mohamed Niang's gone uh, out on loan to Aloha to give him an opportunity to, to play first team football. Yeah, uh, absolutely, and he was, uh, the great thing about Senna is he, he was really, really keen to get out and play, he didn't want to sit about and, you know, we were trying to get him to have some chances in midfield, but in your know, midfield, I, I would say we're as strong as most teams in the league, and we've got two or three players in that look. I mean, we've even played uh, Young Turner on the right hand side, where he did a fantastic job, but we know that's not his best position. So uh, that was a really strong area of the pitch. So it was, it was a great move all round. It's a good standard. You know, they're a really good. Them and our both have been the kind of premier part time clubs in Scotland over the last few years. So. Yeah, it'll be great for him and hopefully he gets a lot of game time. He, he's been told he's still very much part of the plans. It's just about getting a bit of experience. Finally, it's quite unusual to get a two-week break at this stage of the season, but it's been helpful for you and beneficial for the, the team, I'm guessing. Yeah, I think so. I think they had a, they had a golf day uh, last week. Uh, how much golf they played, I don't know, but they had a golf day and <laughs> uh, worked hard the rest of the week. We had a game on Friday and some of them trained. Uh, and they'll be working hard this week. So yeah, I mean, it is, I mean, we've got a really, really big game. Uh, we've started very well. There's no getting away from that. But it is only two games. Um, we've got a big, big game against uh, our both who have been fantastic for the last two or three years. Their back four is as good as there is in the league. So it'll be a really hard game. Thanks very much, Gaffer. Cheers, Rose.